Hey guys, so we're going to go over the new parts. Here's the Phoenix Core. It has uh, four large and four small locks. It's right spin. And uh, so far, I think it's going to be small locks first. Because that makes the most sense to right before the blade is uh, knocked off. The uh, prominence blade is knocked off. Here's prominence. Um... Basically, when it has a strong attack, the Pranus shield will come off to release the impact of, and prevent bursts. A defense-type right-handed rotating blade that can change the difficulty of coming off depending on the direction in which the Pranus shield is attacked. So yeah, it has basically two rotations, I think, and it comes off at and can come off of that depending on when it's attacked as well. Oh wait, it can just go off in two different directions, that's what it is. Basically, it's meant to come off for left and right spin. We have Metal Universe. Large hemispherical shaft and the outer ring rotate freely. And basically, it's just universe, but with metal as the core. And that's not really good. It was already a pretty semi-okay driver, probably around B tier-ish. Uh, maybe C tier. But, oh, yeah, no, this ain't good. If it was a double chassis system, uh, I'd be ha I'd be fine with it. But no, no, this ain't gonna be good. Get a normal universe or universe dash instead, if you can find a universe dash. Is that is that a thing? I don't think it is. So well, just find a normal universe. And here's the per Perseus core. This is Star God Perseus motif. Right handed DB core with metal parts arranged along circled to dramatically increase centrifugal force and attack power. Basically, increases the uh, weight distribution towards the center to increase for faster spin because you go a little bit faster if you uh, move the mo mo most weight inwards. That's basically what its thing is. So, it'll be great for attack power. Here's Metal Drift, and that's okay because on Roar Bahamut, uh, Central Fuel Force and stability are high due to the low overall height. Yep, if you're rotating shaft of large quad parts, the defensive driver with improved re performance and reinforced springs with metal lock parts. And here's Bearing Dash. Okay, now I know what you're thinking. Orange. Why is it orange? Well, here's the thing. It's not completely a dash driver. It's basically a step up of the original bearing which had a weak, weak spring for bearing. But it should have a stronger spring, just it's basically now a normal bearing now. <laughs> With it, but it has a little bit higher attack power thanks to it. So that's okay. Here's Belial. It has a right, it's right hand DB core with burst locks when shooting strongly. So basically if you launch it hard, Burst locks will come out of, the, out of the core, which will prevent the bay blade from bursting, which is actually not bad. I like the design. It's going to look good. Here is All Might or Almighty, depending on how, it comes, how its final part name is, comes out. It's a flat shaft tip that rotates freely, and it is part with a bouncing function, adds endurance and defensive power to attacks. Basically, as we've shown in the anime, Except at, not in the, anime, in the uh, last video and how it showed the part comes up, it that is what happens when it launches really strongly. So I think that'll come. It's basically going to be sort of like a reverse uh, reboot, sort of. It looks like if I'm reading it correctly, and the other one will come up with a spring. Basically, it's going to have a. Th a defensive mode, which will be in its highest spin, and it'll switch to attack mode still, I think. The shaft tip is basically performed, uh, basically improves mobility. It's, oh, it just has defensive powerful attack, sorry. And it's basically, it's going to ha have increased attack power, but then it'll go into stamina mode. It will still have good attack power. Here's Dangerous. Great attack type layer by the looks of it. Again, reminds me of 
old Valkyrie, not cho not any other, not the newer ones, not a single layer of Valkyrie. It's the one from the manga. It looks really good. It reminds me of that design, so it's going to be really good for attack. The uh, Basically, it's going to have high repulsion due to the high rubber filled inside the bit blade. blade and it's going to look really good. And that's it. So, uh, please comment your thoughts. Seriously, this could change a little bit more of the meta. We could get some good right spin attack power. Who knows, it could even beat Guilty. Uh, we don't know yet, but we'll see. Please send me your thoughts in the comments below. And we'll see what we do, what we uh, are going to have happen next. Until next time, let it rip.